Hey everyone, how you doing? I'll tell you how I'm doing. I've got food in my belly. Food. Bacon and eggs. Splendid. So, oh, that's nice. Uh, we're going to go back to our speed run, which isn't a speed run. We've got our normal opening. This is my normal repertoire. And we've got an Italian, so I'm going Russo Gambit. Hopefully you take. I'll push D3, we'll get into a Lucchini. I already did a short video on the Lucchini earlier on today. I found a, a line where I got absolutely uh, <clears throat> violated. Hey, Lucchini, how you doing? My old friend, or Lucchini, come on. Fried liver me, ish. So without, without this pawn here and this pawn here, this, this would be the fried liver attack. But what I learned today so d5 is no good defense. Mm -mm. Oh, beauty. Oh, you beauty. Oh, you beauty. Right. Are we going to be able to remember our moves? I need a shave, don't I? Wow. Okay, so what is the point of this move f4? Well, you're disconnecting the bishop's defense of the knight. The knight is now hanging. It's under attack and undefended. So what are you going to do? Either you retreat, which is poor, or you go knight f7 with a fork on queen and rook, thinking, what can possibly go wrong? Watch this space. Or you go there with the bishop, in which case it's king f8, and that's a completely different line. But the problem with, there we go, okay, queen h4 it is. I love this opening. And, of course, we're tempting white to take there, in which case we play queen takes f2, check mate. He's not going to do that. g3 is most likely. And if g3, we just slide our queen in there. And then if they take the rook, we're going to bring in our knight and put triple pressure. Actually, if, it were, if they take now, we just bring out the knight. Oh, or castle. Okay, now. <coughs> Castles, schmarsels. Okay, yeah, it's it's knight f6. You could play knight h6, but then white has a uh, an option to take the knight rather than the rook, which is still fine for black, I think. So I think this is all still theory. Okay, and there we go. Whoop, dip, diddly bit. Here we go. Okay, now the only move is h3, I think, because we're threatening queen takes h2 checkmate. No other move makes sense. And then what is it? We take the pawn on f2, hitting Mrs. Queen. And really here the rook should take the knight. King can't go in the corner. King could go to h2. If rook takes, it's queen takes. Where is it bishop takes? We're also threatening knight h8 takes h3, double check, which is nasty. Um, I'm trying to remember what to do. Bear with. Queen takes. Yeah, this doesn't really do anything. Okey coke. Double check then time, isn't it? Yeah? Double check, king has to move. Then I believe we're doing fine and dandy. I'm actually down three points right now because I've lost a rook for, for two pawns. Um, double check. The king has to move. So the king is going here or here. Now. The king goes in the corner. So what I want to do, oh, is that the move? No, it's just this, isn't it? Either, either one, either one. There, 
is a discovered check by the queen, hitting white's queen, right? What white want, is going to have to do, because he can't move the king, right? So he can't take the knight because it's defended by the bishop, can't move into check. The only legal move then is for the queen to block, and then knight takes queen. I think it's the same here. Knight g5 discovered check. King still can't go there. Queen still has to. It doesn't, it doesn't make any difference. Let's do this one. I'm just going to win the queen now, yeah? Opponent is Ahmed Kamel 666 from Egypt, by the look of it. All right. Let me just take the lady, yeah? Kidnap, kidnap pilot's wife, issue demands. King H1 is forced. Checkmate, I think. <laughs> Happy days. Right, let's go and review. Okay, here we are on the analysis board. Let's hit review. Come on, hit me. <laughs> oh, the power of food. See, my brain was actually working okay. I was... Uh, because I've just broken my, my three-day dry fast. Um, my energy levels were high, but the hunger was making me a little bit kind of... I couldn't really concentrate all that well. Although I did do a couple of quite highly rated games. But 95, dude. One inaccuracy. And I bet that's F5 anyway. Um, so let's go through it. <sighs> okay. That's my inaccuracy, right? And it's like, dude, it's, dude, don't play that. Don't play that. It's stupid. No, it's not stupid. It works really well. Bishop c5 is best. The Lucini Gambit is best. The Dubois variation. I didn't know there were other variations, but... Okay, and this is inaccurate from, from white, um, but so tempting. Actually, the, the more common moves are castles. I think castles is, is the most common that I find. You also have knight c3. But this is really what you want to do. If they do this, you are rubbing your hands, bruv. Okay? And F6, like we say. We cut off the knight. We force the issue. So bishop F7 check is, is tempting. But then white knows the, the king's just going to move. This is far more likely. Right? And again, inaccurate. And it gives an equal position. Boom. A great move. Great move, number one. Again, inaccurate. But it's still only half a pawn in my favour. Doesn't like that. Was there something? Have I missed something here? No. No. The knight comes out. We're playing a human being. Oh, lordy. And now it's all gonna end in tears. Mm -mm. You took my rook. You shouldn't have done that. Great move number two. F pretty much forced. Pretty much forced. Best move. Best move. Best move. Uh-oh. Forced mate in nine. This permits the opponent to win a queen, so I double check. Best move. Bang. And then boom. Shakalaka. Boom, boom. And that, my friends, is what they call... Curtains and it's forced mate in two. 2350, get in. 1350 for opponent is playing around his, his, his correct level, but that, my friends, is what can happen when you know <clears throat> a gambit. And yeah, there's always a risk. There's always a risk. But in fact, I was never worse, never really worse here. It didn't like that. And with like best play, I think it's I think it's d3, I think it's d3 here for. Actually, d4 is saying is is better the computer. I mean, no, in fact, d3 we know d3 is is what we have. So, yeah, and then you should really take here. Fe is is also playable. I think maybe it does better in practice, but you know you can play on from here. This is not terrible, but smack bang wallop. Suck my Lucchini. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching. See you soon.